Look at that, so they pulled up a cannon. Wow, that's crazy. Hey, good morning guys, and welcome back to the vlog. Today, we're in Vicksburg, Mississippi at a national park here. It's a national military park. And right behind me here is an ancient, like, battleship, right? It's called an ironclad. It's the Cairo or Cairo um, ironclad ship that was sunk a hundred, over 100 years ago. It was sunk in, like, what? 1862. 1862. Yeah, 1862, it was sunk right here outside of town. And then in 1964, 102 years later, they brought it up out of the river and kind of restored part of it and put it here in this national park. So we're gonna go in, check it out, and uh, see what it's all about. All right, well, let's get in here and check it out. Sarah? Yeah, there's all the spiders. There are, huh? So here, guys, is part of the steam engine. You've got these big pistons here that run it, right, and turn the paddle wheel there in the back. These right here are the boilers for the steam engine. So it says this boat used a ton of coal an hour and could go nine miles an hour is the top speed. This right here is a big winch. You've got the cannons. Right up here is where the pilot would be. And so he could be up in there, right, and it's all iron sheeting there to protect them but uh yeah so they pilot it from up there here you can see the cannons and the iron siding on the boat so this was actually sunk by a mine here in a river really close to here the yazoo river they added the iron railroad railroad rails over there for added protection did you see that yep railroad rails right here they recovered this ship out of the river in the 1960s brought it up here and reconstructed it and so these are some of the original timbers original timbers over here as well and the iron plating right, and so they brought it up out of the river brought it here to the national park and reconstructed it okay of course this stuff like right up here above me is new reconstructed or rebuilt stuff but um a lot of original pieces here as well all right time to go into the museum and see they're supposed to have a lot of artifacts that they got from the boat Oh, here's a cool picture of the boat right here. All right, so here's some of the things that they've collected. Wow, look at that. It's cool, it's broken, sir. Let's go down this way and check out some of the artifacts. See, it says that all artifacts here are from the USS Cairo. And uh, so we're gonna see what they've got. Wow, big bell. <laughs> That's cool. That's the ship's bell, sir. Mm -hmm. Wow, here's them pulling up. Look at that, sir. They pulled up a cannon. Wow, that's crazy. Huh. Oh, they pulled this up. It was all in one piece. 1960. Huh. Well, there's the paddle wheels. They're a little oh, wow. destroyed. Like Big pieces of the ship came up. Whole pieces. Mm -hmm. Sir, it had been down there for a hundred yeah. and like 102 years. It's crazy. That's a long time. So here it is right here. You can see the new wood and the old. Here's a model of what it looked like originally. Huh. Interesting. A lot of guns came up out of there. And swords or sabers. Other different artifacts. Cannonballs and different shells. Silverware. <laughs> Look at the, the cooking ware, silverware. This is the officer's tableware. Which is the officer's tableware. But then this is the sailor's. Wow, look at the difference. <laughs> the regular guy's like stuff. Yes, yeah, that's nice. <laughs> look at these people who carved their initials in the bottoms of them. Somebody carved a star in the bottom of their plate. Wow, that person has nice handwriting. It's cool, huh? Oh, faucets and hooks and things. Piece of the anchor right there. Locks and keys. What is this thing? A bedpan. These are still full of like the medicines huh. and stuff. Really? Yeah. Huh. Like number three is two thirds full of ammonia. Really? Mm -hmm. Interesting. Different kinds of personal effects here and uh, different coins that they found the soldiers had. Whistles and flutes. A uh, little information room. You can read about all different stuff about the ship and it's sinking. This is the guy that, the man that actually designed it. 
James Buchanan Eads. Hmm. Cool. And they're named, there's how many, Seth? Seven different gunboats or armored boats oh, yeah. like these? Yeah. And they were named after the um, rivers along the Mississippi and Ohio rivers. Cities. It's cool. This is the National Cemetery down there. You can see all the graves. There's about 17,000 soldiers buried there. When you come to this park, it's basically a long driving tour. It'll take you, they say, about an hour just to drive through the park. And on one side is the, um, the Union side, the other side is the Confederate side. And they have a lot of different monuments and statues and things like that where you can, um, you can stop and you can read the plaques and learn a lot about the park. Um, like Jules was just saying about the National Cemetery back there, you can check that out as well. We're back at the Visitor Center. We actually started today here, and then I didn't start the vlog until we got over to the ship. But we're coming back here because the kids, um, they, they got part of this Junior Ranger program. Sarah. What is the Junior Ranger Program? So the Junior Ranger Program is a program for kids when you go to national parks and stuff and you get this um, fancy book and you go through and you answer questions and do little activities and at the end you get a Junior Ranger badge and yeah, it's really fun. They're cool souvenirs too. So basically it's a program to motivate kids to learn, right? And so yeah, they give them the activity book and projects, but uh, yeah, so they learn about the park more and are more engaged and active when they're here with their parents. And you get a cool little badge. I hope yeah. you get it. Did you guys finish the book? Visitor Center. Whew, let's cruise on in. Show you guys around a little bit. Hope the kids get their badge. Here you've got the gift shop. Like we've seen in most other national parks, big gift shop. This one's kind of small compared to others. And then here we've got different uh, museum artifacts, displays. Uh -huh. Hi. And your name? Oh, Sarah. Sarah. Okay. I'm proud to be a National Park Service Junior Ranger. I'm proud to be a National Park Service Junior Ranger. Cool. Yeah. Vicksburg. They gave us this. Playing cards. Um, trading cards. That's cool. You know, okay, so we got these and then trading cards, and I've been sworn in as a junior ranger probably like six times. Because <laughs> each time you go to a national park, you get sworn in again and get another badge. It's really fun. That is just a taste of the national park here in Vicksburg, Mississippi. If you're coming through the area, highly recommend stopping here and checking it out. And so guys, we hope you have a really great day, and keep smiling.